Entrusted with the captaincy armband at 23, Mtembo has come through the Sharks Academy ranks. He made his debut for the Durban Outfit in 2012. Like I said, I'm fairly young. I still got a lot to learn. I'm, I'm fortunate that I've got all the guys with me that will help me throughout uh, the campaign. But then if I get the backing of my players, then I should be fine. It seems he has that support. To, to choose someone as a leader of a group of people because of, uh, because of the, the colour of their skin is, is not what we're about. I think the fact that he's been able to, he's been afforded the opportunities to play and when he's played, he's played well, he's put his hand up and through that he's earned the respect of his peers. Um, a decision like this is not done by a CEO or a coach, it's done by the people around him and how they react to him and that I think is the important part. It's fantastic that the progression is shown just to where the game of rugby can go to in this country. Brad McLeod Henderson will coach the Curry Cup squad. So what role will Jake White play? Jake's role will obviously be far less from a blowing of the whistle point of view. You know, he will, he'll spend little to no time with the senior team. I think his role will be to do a, a bit of a rugby audit in terms of, of what's lying ahead, um, to spend time with our 19 team and then uh, to spend time with our 21s, to look into our rugby academy, to see where and how we can improve our academy to make sure that it remains the best rugby academy in the country. And uh, along the while, choosing a Super 15 squad already. Mtemo will hit the ground running when the Sharks take on Greek was and Kimberley next week. Blaine Herman, SABC News, Durban.